Um, so happy to have everyone. Uh, I want to recap some of the great things that we discussed uh, today. We're going to have the Economic Justice Jam facilitator, one of them. Uh, Nikki's going to come up, and then we're going to have uh, some high school student uh, talk about his stuff. Nikki. Um, so during this jam, uh, the NYCLU gave us a number of issues that they were really interested in exploring with data. Um, so there were three that we focused on. One was segregation in schools. So according to a UCLA study, uh, New York New York State is actually the most segregated in the country. So we um, looked into potential data to help us understand, uh, you know, segregation in schools. We looked at the concept of million dollar blocks. Has anybody seen that exhibition? It was at MoMA years ago. Chicago has been now doing work in that vein. Um, so we kind of had a broad idea of this, you know, the idea that there's certain particular blocks that are heavily policed and as a result, um, cost millions of dollars to taxpayers, right? So it's, it's a play on the idea that they would be blocks that are full of expensive housing. Um, but so we, we had that as a general concept um, to discuss. And then we also looked at um, the cost of incarceration. So who actually pays for cr or the criminal justice system in its totality? Who actually pays for it? Um, with the idea that sometimes people who move through the system pay for it. Um, so we had three different working groups. Um, we focused on generating ideas, ideas about data rather than just kind of jumping in and building. Um, Rebecca Ackerman, who's not here, did an intro um, where she talked about starting with questions and then thinking about data that could um, address those questions and then creating new questions and then looking at new data um, so that it just to kind of you know kind of tap into the complexity of this work um, so I just wanted to show this picture to show a little bit of process this was from the group that I sat in with um, that dealt with million dollar blocks and these were some of the questions that came up um, and what we did was we just freeform um, talked about certain issues that we thought were were interesting to look at like the review process of officers subject to civilian complaints um, you know, precincts, what are the stats in precincts um, generally through the city versus those in NYCHA housing? What about pretrial detention centers? Who's in pretrial detention and where do they come from? Um, and we started asking questions and then we started blocking off in green, you can see the green squares go around variables. So then we could make this actionable. We could say, okay, we've got these squared off variables, then can we, you know, choose to and, and put them against each other and, and do something with it and explore more? Um, and just to kind of conclude with this with this group, people were like, well, how does this relate back to million dollar blocks? And then we were like, well, maybe it doesn't have to, right? Like maybe this process brought us to a new place. So um, I hope that the NYCLU is able to use this information. I think folks who participated um, expressed interest in continuing. So I think it was really exciting and I thank everybody for being a part of it. So that's all.